Yes, lads, Joe Bleen here, and today we're going over campaigns in FIFA Mobile Season 2. So, massive thanks to EA for flying me out to Vancouver so I could record this footage for you guys. Um, the build we're using is a test build, it's not a final build, so not everything is final that you see here in terms of rewards and costs and all of that. But the campaigns, they have replaced Seasons Mode. So, Seasons Mode is gone campaigns are here in return so the main campaigns that you'll be getting stuck into are essentially the league campaigns so you've got england spain germany italy france western europe eastern europe north america and south america and rest of world so these work similar to seasons you work your way through playing all the teams some more than once in various methods so you may do a penalty shootout you may play half a game where you're already winning you may play an attacking scenario, you may play a first half where you're already winning, you may, be, you may not be, and then you get rewards along the way and or not the next chapter. So they've all got five chapters and you go along as so. Where it gets harder as you go along the way, the rewards get better, the teams get harder. Chapter two, you face an 80 rated Grimsby. So although you're seeing low rated teams, their overalls are increased to make it harder, but the rewards get better. As you can see here, you're getting gold players, you're getting FIFA points, 100 FIFA points finishing Chapter 2, Chapter 3, even more nodes, they get harder, they do have certain requirements, so let's find one, for example, um, the rewards change, and you need different overalls to be able to actually get into them, so where's one, for example, I'm just trying to help, so here, Chapter 3, you need to have at least a 75 overall team before you can go any further. 84 rated, not only 75 overall. Chapter 4, there's 30 to do here. Straight away, you need to unlock the private, private chapters. I'll be using the 80 overall team. Um, so it gets harder and the rewards get better, as you can see here. Like I say, these rewards aren't final, so they may be adjusted. But the rewards go up, you get more. The stamina cost go up as well. Um, as you get closer because you are in each of these working towards a campaign master player so there's big rewards at the end where we reach chapter five and there you can see it completing the england chapter gets you a 90 rated paul pogba center midfield card obviously this year you can train so you can get that pogba up higher you can play him wherever you want I've got other videos focusing on all of these. This is just a campaign video. So check out my other videos that I've already uploaded or to, still to come. We've got lots of season two videos for you. And we upload FIFA Mobile every single day. I'll probably be uploading twice daily, three times daily at the start at least because I've got so many videos for you guys. Massive props to EA for making this possible. But in chapter five, when it gets serious, you're playing like, 99 overall Liverpool and you need to have won 50 league tournaments so these aren't final and from speaking to EA while I'm here it looks like they're going to lower the requirements for some of these because 50 league tournament wins uh, where it, Swansea there needs at least 100 wins in league tournaments that's minimum 100 days they've put these in place because they don't want you to be able to unlock him day one because obviously you know someone's going to sweat it out hard with stamina to try and unlock Pogba day one Due to you needing league wins as a requirement to unlock and progress further, that's not going to be possible. They are going to lower it because they've realised you're realistic looking at about three, four months to get Pogba. Four months' time, we don't know where we're at with the game. Pogba and May no longer be worth it. So they are going to look into lowering those just because we were saying they, as much as it makes sense, it's a little bit more. And then you've got like final ones here 110 rated Southampton you have to face. So these are going to be hard but the rewards are certainly worth it. You also get in the chapter five, a special Zahar, a special Walker, a special Sigurdsson, a special Koscielny. And the rewards here, at least gold rated or better players, 5,000 coins. The rewards are insane. So like I showed you, some are skill games, some are full games, some are park games, some are scenarios. It's a mix up of it all. And it's pretty decent indeed. If you enjoy playing four games, you're going to enjoy this. If you don't enjoy playing four games, the rewards will make you want to play it. So it's the rewards people want, and it's the rewards we will get out of it. So it's very nice indeed. Obviously, you can look at this Pogba here. It looks like a very nice card indeed. An absolutely unreal card, if I must say. So these are campaigns. Are you looking forward to it? Let me know in the comments below. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new here. Come follow me on Twitter at JBHD and I'll see you all later. Peace.